and now we are playing chapter 7 um, by, from Adventure Escape Mysteries Midnight Carnival so Jack saw this hooded man and let's chase him and uh, he we can take a sparkle now let's uh, go in what do we have here we have a closed door it's unusual and uh, but we can go in first we need to activate uh, this button and then activate the second button now it's uh, light points to the door and we can go in and before going in let's go here and take a part of an Eiffel Tower picture and uh, here's the green room so let's go in the room looks normal but it's almost green all of them here so here we can take a bird and also we can place a, a part of a towel here to get uh, another button we have nothing to do here right now so going out insert this button here activate it so we can see that at one time two buttons must be activated and now this uh, the door is uh, lighted with the stripes and let's go in so here's another room right now here we can take teacup here we can take a, a swirly button also we can uh, insert bird into the clock and we've got uh, the first uh, letter uh, we will need to get six letters and then uh, rearrange them and also let's notice that there are books all the books on the bookshelves are green it's also a hint and next we have a swirly button let's activate it and we can go now into the third type of a room so what do we have here we can take a wheel uh, here we can take a lampshade and also here we can notice a beer without his uh, friend girlfriend nothing to do here right now so going out and uh, we need to turn back to the striped room and uh, attach uh, the wheel to the bicycle to get the pin and with this pin we need to go out pop uh, all these balloons and get uh, another button it's purple button and now this purple button foot fits here and uh, so we have uh, a set of green rooms here and now let's uh, activate purple and uh, we will have a set of purple rooms and okay let's start from the beginning and going in so we ca can see that this was uh, the green room but now it's purple and everything is upside down but we can collect books here and also we have a lampshade to attach it here and the clock is activated and we've got another hint with the letter going out switching the room to a striped going in here's also everything upside down here we can take a friend for the our bear and also we have set of uh, purple books to put all of them on the bookshelves and we have got the hint from uh, this clock and uh, next going out let's check uh, this room now so here we can see a pair of bears uh, sitting in the clock but we have a key cup let's attach it here to also to activate the clock we've got one more hint also here's a part of the heart and now let's uh, go back to the green rooms so first we need to not here but here we need to give the teddy uh, bear to his friend to get the hint and also to put the ha half of a heart on its position to get the last hint with the letter now we need to rearrange this letter in, in the correct order and the hint is also shown here time is uh, but a sequence of events so we need to look um, at the, all of these clocks and uh, look at the time and the uh, letters and uh, rearrange uh, this uh, time and letters according to uh, according to the uh, time in time order uh, now let's turn here and uh, we can notice that this is uh, looks like a digit free but it is upside down so it is letter E 
uh, he will have it's uh, not uh, 6 but it's a letter G and uh, the last room this one is not uh, 7 but it's letter L and uh, okay if we use the, the correct sequence of time we can get that uh, here we are to type the word uh, legacy So we've got uh, one more button. Let's insert it here and uh, go in. So what do we have there? Here's Madame Magician's wagon there. Going further. <laughs> 